So Paul and I are hiking over here to that uh, rock right in the middle that is on top of the rock below it. And then if we're uh, ambitious, we might even climb this here miniature version of uh, Ayers Rock in uh, Australia, Alice Springs. No kangaroos though, yet. All right. Okay, so there you see some rocks over here and that will kind of show you the steepness of the hillside. And so there's Paul intently taking his pictures. <laughs> I'm just going to kind of sneak over here and brave these thorny bushes a little bit. And take a look in the rocks here. Staying away from any uh, crevices or anything where snakies can jump out at me. Let me turn the light on here, see if I can illuminate things. Uh, yeah, light's barely going to do anything. And if you look up, we've got ravens. Okay. I like the little line going through the rock and then another above. Yeah, and then you see the line going up through that one. So it's kind of interesting how the, you know, some, some time in the uh, forming of the strata, that line would have been flat instead of going up at a 45 degree angle. Are those, uh, are those vultures circling us? <laughs> I hope not. We have made it. And unfortunately, as we got up here, a flock of uh, birds, quail or something, shot out of the tree over there, and I missed them. Camel wasn't ready. But there is our rock destination. Yeah, there is our little balanced rock. <laughs> and I remember over in, uh, what was it, the Red Rock Canyon by Colorado Springs, some idiot kid went and pushed a balanced rock off of its pedestal in the park there. And that was a stupid one. But yeah, there we go. Okay, so this is the back side of the rocks. Yeah, it's interesting. How did they get piled up here? You know, it had to come from somewhere. Yeah, oh, okay. Okay, what are these things? A little dried berry of some sort. <laughs> There's not much sustenance out here, but we are getting some leafage on these plants. Paul and I have reached the access area 
the back side of the mountain you can see where the slope is much less here so that even us full figured guys can climb it <laughs> paul on the other hand he should be able to handle this like the best of mountain scramblers like the, like the mountain goat scrambler you bet the mountain goat scrambler himself <laughs> This looks like it. Right there. Yeah. Okay, let us go. Yeah, this stuff's pretty grippy. So this is kind of cool. The <clears throat> with the rocks have <clears throat> worn holes in them. This is Paul. Catching some breath. So we know there's a view up there. More than one made it up there. Okay, we are making it up a little ways. Got this nice granite face that we climbed up here. That was good. <laughs> yeah. We're both uh, gaining, catching our breaths here. So the people down in this area, they're camped outside of the BLM, aren't they? Uh, no, I think BLM actually starts back up there. Okay. It says, because it says when you come in, it's got that 14 day sign on it. Oh, okay. It just says, uh, I think it just says Indian Rocks right here, but it says BLM out there. Okay. So everything out there is BLM land. Yeah, and usually those 14 day signs ex say, except Paul. 15 days. And, and friends. Paul and friends, 15. Yeah. <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry. Yeah, don't worry about it. What could go 14 wrong? 14 days, 14 days, don't worry about it. Yeah, yeah. That's just a suggestion. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a suggestion. for newbies. That's the ticket. That, that's to keep it clear for when Paul wants to come out here. And, Absolutely. You know. Make sure the riffraff doesn't come Yeah, what do you mean the riffraff? You are the riffraff. <laughs> hey now. Hey, wait I a minute. Resemble I resemble that. <laughs> yeah, I like that flat face over there. There's I can. What's that? There's I can right over there. Oh, yeah, yeah. And ooh, the booming ghost town of Bis. What was it? Uh, what was the name of that? Town? Bowie. Bishop. I don't know if it's Bowie or Bowie. Bowie? Oh, I have to look okay, it up. Bowie. I don't know how they pronounce it. I think it's Bowie. David Bowie. My guess. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, it's just interesting how the weather has uh, eroded the rocks. Paul is making his way up. You see, there's a water track that comes down into a pool there, and then water falls on down. And then I'm presuming the Cracks under the granite are from years of freezing, thawing, heating, cooling. But we're getting up here. We've got more cool rocks. I'll show that in a minute. So I just find it interesting how <clears throat> you have these uh, different strata layers in the rock. Granite below, granite above, and then whatever that is in between. <clears throat> and I don't know. Uh, how does the other side look? I didn't look over there. But you know, you see different kind of rocks forming in the layers between. You know, this isn't the best, but you have dark, light, dark. And over there you have granite, then some kind of line above it. Then you have a coarser, like a quartz line. Then you go back to granite, and then quartz, and then like a granite, and then back to full granite. So. Very interesting. Maybe we can find some information 
on the interweb about it. All right. Okay, we're at the next level. View's getting bigger. Whew. It's the next air stop. Paper bag, paper <laughs> Let's see, there's a little pool of water on top of that rock. Orange or reddish. Oh, yeah. Huh. Huh. Cattle trails down there. It almost looks like uh, circling of the wagons for oh, the yeah. rocks there. Huh. See, that's where those tall things are. They're oh. coming out of that plant. Oh. Whatever it is. It's some kind of. Uh... Some uh, kind of a desert plant. What do you call it? Something? Uh, bayonet something. Bayonet something. Well, if any viewers know what it is, your comment. Oh, yeah, yeah. If any viewers know what that plant is, let us know. <sighs> oh, there's our hiking buddies, or the, our next door neighbors camping, anyway. Okay. Yeah. Top of the world, Mo! <laughs> I'm on top of the world! So we got up here, and Paul decided to take out all of his dolls and play in the water for a while. Hey, yeah, don't give my secrets away. <laughs> People are really thinking in the same way. I think I'm a freak. <clears throat> Freaked out! <laughs> yeah. Do your, uh, do your uh, Mount Everest pose there, buddy. Get, get over here and get that rock. And I'll make sure I get the, the puddle full of uh, dolls in there. <laughs> yeah, these damn toys. Oh. Kelly's gonna like Majestic. that. Majestic. Kelly's gonna like that. Okay, so Paul has been playing with his dolls for about two hours now. And Paul, it's time to go. Put your dolls back. <laughs> that, trusty, that's gonna hit the editing pool, right? Oh, yeah. No, 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 I'm no, no. Watch that. No, no, no. I'm gonna watch that video. <laughs> and if that's in there, boy, you wanna talk about getting recorded on YouTube. <laughs> okay, so be it known, these are not Paul's dolls, but I am having fun with it. And, uh,. Uh, yeah, they were just up here. We got to the top and uh, I think there's a couple of kids that were running up here and they we saw them with the green inner tube things. So I'm pretty sure the kids brought up the dolls and uh, so they're just having some fun. I, obviously they must have known that there was a uh, pools up at the top here. So cool. Huh. And they've got their stuff is here. So they'll be back. They'll be back. But yeah, glad we came up here, Paul. It was a good idea. Oh, it was an equal. Let's see, this here, it looks like this is another one of those hard belts of rock that was between the granite. And, you know, it kind of like is shaped into an almost perfect wall. Unless um, somebody long ago had uh, formed it. Because so I think this granite... Um, chips away pretty easily it's not like the strong granite that's been compressed for billions of years but yeah oh, oh i think this is the rock that paul was trying to get me to camp under <laughs> 
No, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> That was shaky. Yeah, look like you're look like you're pushing on it. Yeah. Oh. Do that. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> have some good Kelly shots here. Oh yeah, yeah. Here now, wait. Got to get this one here. Okay, hold on. Yeah. Holding this rock by sheer force. <laughs> Jeff Atlas. Jeff Atlas. Charles Atlas ain't got nothing on you. Absolutely. Oh, I Atlas. I had that course. Oh, you did? You ever see any of it? The uh, Atlas. Working? Charles Atlas? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember. I did that stuff. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So I did that when I was younger. It was funny. Oh, yeah. I suppose I should actually be holding the camera up when I'm taking video. See, there's more of those holes in the rocks. And we're picking up some wind here. I'm really hoping that, that open stretch is, is not like this when we go down. Yeah. That wouldn't be the greatest spot. Now. Well, you know, we may look over the front here and think... Uh, those guys went down <laughs> if those you see it going down that way, yeah. it's really steep. Oh. It might be a little shorter, but it's hard to Hey, you gotta remember I used to be a slalom racer. Yeah, you <laughs> Yeah, you you go ahead and slalom that. So you see if you look at those rocks with the shiny on them, that's water. That's water. We've got another little pool here, but that one's dried out. has a piece of uh, firewood in it. See, here's what looks like a rock wall, but I think this is just harder material here that didn't erode like the rest of it. So it's pretty cool. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure that this here is a natural, just a natural wall that formed through uh, wind erosion. Okay, so we are back at the far end here now. And you can see our camp down there. Let me get a little closer to camp. I have to stay away from the edge because if I go close to the edge, Kelly is going to give me a severe beating. And so there we go. There is our camp. Oh, and down there, right next to the truck camper, those are the two kids that were up here playing with everything and their folks should have been walking along in here by now but uh, they're all camped in the fifth wheel next to me there all right let's walk over here a little further No, I'm uh, investigating further. I mean, you know, what's nice is it's a very grippy surface.
think it's doable. I'm gonna explore a little bit. Hmm. Okay, well, I do not know what is down there. But grass, there's water here. I mean, this is a nicely sheltered spot. If I was some kind of a critter, I would try and get up here. <laughs> Oh, it looks like uh, I can kind of sneak my way down through this rock here. It's a little steep on the other end. So let's go back out and move over the other way. Ugh. What do we got down here? So there's people gotten over there too. And it's entirely possible that that might be a way out over there. Okay. Saw me lean on that wind and chill. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going back the way we came out. Yeah, but the truck's right there. Yeah, I'd like to arrive in the same condition I'm in right now. See, there's the smart one. <laughs> get myself a truck camper picture yet <laughs> okay so Paul is making his move to come over here and slide down on the butt like I did and um, it's basically not very very tough the rock is grippy so it hangs on to you and what I did is I came down through the track right here and kind of kept close to that edge and then you just kind of let it slip uh you shove over and you get a foot on that rock and then this rock and then come on down <clears throat> yeah. i'll move up here so i can catch you a few feet sooner <laughs> <laughs> so here comes Paul Shackle Hunter down the slide and uh, Paul Shackleford, Antarctica Paul. Yeah. <laughs> or no, the North uh, North Arctic. Yeah, it's the one warm sunny day in the Antarctic where Commander General Paul Shackleford Hunter decided to slide down the mountain. Yeah, you're doing perfect. Perfect, perfect. I say perfect. Yeah, just you know, you just you follow the, the brown track all the way down. <laughs> Are you telling me I'm gonna have to wander after this? There's gonna be a black stick in the back of my jeans. That's right. Not for me. <laughs> well, this is gonna go viral, huh? This is gonna go viral. <laughs> <laughs> Mountain climbing, I mean climbing with Paul. Yeah, okay. From now on, be known as Brown Street Paul. <laughs> <clears throat> there he goes, there goes Brown Streaker. <laughs> He's a demon on wheels. <laughs> so now we have to. 
wasn't actually that bad. Was no, it wasn't, was it? See, Kelly, it wasn't that bad. I'm safe, and Paul's alive. We're both, we're both healthy and ticking. That it looks, uh, looks uh, steeper from right here than it did from up there. A uh, figment of your illusion. Figment yeah. of your illusion. I think I'm gonna make it look as not as steep as possible by oh. scooching up. My You're gonna spider walk all the way down. Well, look at me, I'm walking. I mean, for goodness sake. <clears throat> you know, I think this one here has a uh, brown streak worn into it here. There. He has overcome. Paul in the upright position. Yeah, Paul has gotten up off his butt and joined the human race. Paul has graduated to walking on the, the, uh, back to the <clears throat> it's back in back to the bipedal world <laughs> instead of slug tracking <sighs> well look at the bright side we'll see things we wouldn't have seen otherwise well, I don't want to see certain <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Bones. yeah. Well, I just I, I want to keep this far and wide. I want to keep seeing things. Anything. I haven't broken a bone either. Huh? I have never broken a bone, and I've had some wild ones. I haven't either. I just come off the motorcycle and, and uh, get my knee on the ground to see my kneecap. Oh, sweet. It wasn't broke. Uh huh. Just ripped the flesh. Uh. That's why I got a hundred and thirty stitches. I think it's like. Three layers of skin. Cool. Yeah. So you're like reinforced now. Uh, so you're like all reinforced. Yeah, I don't know about that. Yeah, it's straight ahead. When Al Capone says, yeah, go take out his kneecaps, they're going to have a trouble. <laughs> Boss, this guy's like got the toughest kneecaps I've ever seen. <laughs> well, break him again. Muggsy. Yeah, don't cast the face. <laughs> yeah, oh, no, brutal. No, no. Yeah, uh, the shining. No. Or which one was that? What was the one with uh, uh, breaks your legs? Um, what's his name? Jack what was Nicholson. His guy's name? Wasn't Nicholson? No, 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 no. It was uh, James Conn. James Conn. Oh, okay. Uh, what the hell was it? Uh, it was, uh, misery. Misery. Yeah, yeah. I remember yeah, it. Getting better. Yeah. Like, I really hate that this gonna hurt me more than it's gonna hurt you. <laughs> yeah, I bet. Like, I don't think so. <laughs> How did he finally get out? How, how did he finally get out? Huh? How did he finally get out? I don't remember. You're going to have to watch that. I, I've never watched it. Really? Yeah. I, I watched it decades ago. Oh. Probably when it came out or oh. something like that. Kind of has a, oh, see, there's an interesting white line right through it. Oh, yeah, okay. Now, how do these form? That's where, they, that's where they took his rock and they uh, glued it together. Yeah, yeah. So, no, that wasn't so bad. What? We could have climbed up this side. See, Jeff, Wings, huh? I told you it wasn't that bad. I don't yeah. know why you wanted to go all the way around. Yeah, no, then... The thing I talked to you doing this. See, we would still be hiking down the other side, and then we would have to walk all the way back around. Right. Hey. Oh, man. Somebody didn't pick up their doggie's poop. Imagine that, somebody didn't pick up a dog poop. Oh. Oh. Well deserved rest. Oh. Mr. Paul. We made it. <laughs> that didn't sound right. There. There we go. Oh. I don't oh. think I got that on camera. <laughs> one, oh. one more time. How many ready, ready? Ready? guys are you okay. There, perfect. Yeah. Oh. So here's what we just wow. did. Oh yeah, you can set mine there, please. So here's what we did. Yeah. They never show that, really. No. They never show that. You know, it's hard to find something to give it uh, scale. You know? Yeah. 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 Rub that cup there so we get. Some... Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Give, no problem. Yeah. Give me twenty minutes. Yeah. Twenty minutes. My ass. It's only gonna take me five to walk that way to my van. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, here's what you might do. Huh? Is lay down. Oh, there you go. Like this. Yeah, I can't get too close. Though. So I'm actually, I'm just using you for scale. <laughs> this might be 
Well, the problem with this is, is it looks like it's not straight up. It looks like it's flat. Yeah. And I'll try it. Yeah, that's a problem with it. Back a little bit. That might give some uh, scale to it. Yeah. Let me uh, go. Yeah, I think that, uh, that one we're wondering about, it's a bayonet. Alright, let's see here. This might work, Paul. There. It's a steep one. Woohoo! Made it. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Alright. So, yeah, they got a nice little picnic area, and what was the sign? Oh, Masonic Picnic Ground, built and maintained by the Bowie Lions Club, 1953. Okay. Hmm. All right. Uh. Okay. You probably could stand over here for a. Hey, uh. Huh? Oh, yeah. Uh, stand over here with me and we can show a kind of the angle of the mountain. So, Paul and I are standing straight up, and you can see the slope of the mountain here. It's, uh, probably 50 degrees here and uh, then varying angles up there so it's a pretty good climb that we slipped down anything to say sir glad it's done glad it's done <laughs> glad to be on terra firma terra <laughs> terra terra flatta terra flatta firma we're on firma oh, oh, i think a lot of catches because i looked up like a million it's paying at something or huh. Plant? Paul is going to go nuts trying to figure out what that cactus is. It's not a cactus, I don't think. Or, uh, I think it's some kind of a plant. Yeah. yeah. Are they, do you know what these trees are? Oh, they're not oaks, are they? Are these big ones? Yeah. Uh, could be oak. Yeah. Well, if you see this video and you've watched it this far, without getting any sort of a brain disease uh tell us what kind of plant tree these are okay right. it's uh that's what it was spanish bayonet a spanish bayonet yeah, yeah you're all darkened out there <laughs> that's my best side that's a good side <laughs> okay oh i see what you mean <laughs> <laughs> told you you wouldn't listen to me <laughs> You had, to, you had to go and blow up the damn camera. No. I told you. I told you in the dark. Best picture. Best picture. You, just, you just had to give me an opportunity. That was all. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Spanish bayonet. Spanish That's bayonet. Cool. I knew it was bayonet something. Well, that was cool. I feel very accomplished. Yeah. We and, uh, you know. Good. That was a good hike. It was, and especially, you know, my back, uh, you know, we were starting and stopping, and then there was a lot of bending and crawling and so my back didn't hurt me the whole way i mean it was getting a little bit sore when we started but then when we started then i was you know bending and yeah. using all fours and i could yeah, i could standing, take some weight off it yeah. yeah keep moving and bending <sighs> well as some people would say jeff you could lose about 40 pounds <laughs> minimum hey we don't listen to people we don't need people like that and negativity is a bad thing oh i i i need people to remind me you included so uh, all right
right, next time you got some big fat juicy thing I'm eating, and you can sit there and watch me and see how long that lasts. Well, I did buy some sirloin steaks and hamburgers, so and I've got spaghetti I've got left an and I got you know what I'm gonna do? I got some of those egg noodles. Yeah. I'm gonna take some I got tuna, I'll make a can of tuna yeah. and my normal veggies, um, you know, peppers and onions and throw the tuna in there yeah. i got the alfredo sauce and i think i might come up with something to do. well you know what i've i've got sirloin steak and <coughs> some sour cream and mushroom soup oh i got some uh, we could make some beef I stroganoff some potato. i got some uh some kind of potato soup from uh you know how uh different places like panera they sell in the store yeah, yeah. i got some panera Oh, potato good. soup. Yeah, they usually good. Make potato soup or something. Yeah. Yeah. But we, uh, you know, there's enough stuff if you between, want. We could do beef the, stroganoff. Between the, between the, the, the cup, we, we can each have half of it. And that way we're only getting uh, about half of the sodium we need. <laughs> yeah, well, true. But it's not bad, though, really. It's like 480, but, 480 milligrams per serving. Since, it's like, if, if we were working with a whole number as my body being one, you would be two thirds. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. Right. Maybe. Doesn't that thing have a weight thing? Yeah. So, yeah. so if we're over a certain weight, you can have more. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, I like that. Uh, yeah, that's a ticket. <laughs> well, I resemble it. All right, I'm going to uh, shut it down. Yeah. Well, there it is. It comes out pretty good. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, we're standing here like a couple of dummies, and all of a sudden, you notice that? Yeah, that does come out pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah. That was amazing. So that looks like a uh, looks like some... elk, deer. Yeah. I don't think it's a moose, though. Uh, antlers. No, no, no. Yeah. It could be a reindeer. Yeah. But bear paw. Yeah, that's a bear paw. That's a bear paw. Hey, there's uh, Jeff's butt print. You know, I can yeah. tell it's got a brown streak in the middle. Yeah. Well, that that this that looks like Paul screaming as he was hey, coming hey, down. That's not Paul. That was Jeff. <laughs> oh, hey, hey, here it is. What? Here's your here's your sliding down. See? Yeah, got yeah, brown, yeah. Got the brown in the center. Of got it. the brown right down the middle. <laughs> the brown zipper. <laughs> brown zip line. Oh, man. Any others over here? I'm gonna head back get something. Time to eat something. That was hard work. Yeah, but and fun. Look at those kids, man. Yeah, they're doing da, good. Da, 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 just, I mean, look at that. Huh. Remember when I came around that rock? I was holding on for dear life. Yeah, it was, was like, like screw it. I'm not going that. We got it right. Hey, I'll I'll admit to that any day. It's kept me alive many a time. Yeah, yeah, it was. <laughs> It has worked well for me all these 60 years. Yeah, it's kept me alive. Uh, <clears throat> like, like not putting my beard down and watch this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, kids. Hey, mom. <laughs> that is usually the <clears throat> famous last words. Hey, watch this. Yeah, hey, what, what do we got here? Bowie, Bowie Lions, 1976. 1976. Wow. Oh, that's held up a while. This thing's been here for... Oh, since the 50s. 40... 50s over there. Huh? That plaque, I think, is 59. Really? Huh? Let us double check. Paul's on a mission to prove me right again. Oh, care less. You always think I'm trying to prove you wrong. Yeah, it's uh, 53. Oh, you know what, though? Huh? I'll bet you money. Huh? That that is the Lions Club since has been around since 1953, not this, because that, that oh, says yeah. 1976. Yeah, you and your particular details. <laughs> hey, uh. like like the saying goes, you may not like the facts, but that doesn't change the yeah. matter. You yeah, know? yeah, it doesn't change the facts because you don't like them. See, so, you know, that looks like a triangle carved in here. Yeah. A little bit. I think the, I think that. Uh, oh, you know what it is. The best, you know what that is. I bet what? you, that's the oh. Mason's triangle. Huh? The Mason triangle. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah, Mason. That's yeah, what it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah that's the Masonic that's triangle. Yeah. Oh, okay. You know what? Look, you know, at, 
Look at the bottom. It's got uh, that eye. Yeah. Remember that eye they got? Oh, yeah. The, unse the unseen eye or what do they yeah, call it? Yeah. yeah, that's what that is. Yeah, this one here, that looks like a kid. Now, there's the head right. and two legs. But yeah, I'll bet you're right on that one. Yeah. Hey, you better you better get that recorded. That's the last time you're going to hear it. Oh, it you're right on that. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you for saying that again. Okay.